Dr. Rizzo, at the Retina World Congress, you presented a talk on artificial vision, everything you need to know. So you outline your, your presentation for us? Yes, my presentation will be about our experience uh, about the 13 plants of Argos 2 in our patient in Italy. I think we are, we are the um, most intense center for these surgeries. And uh, because we start in 2011, in November 2011, we were, we were the first to, to implant the first available comestible implant in, in the world. We start in Pisa, the, I, the, then we followed, we continue in Florence. Now I'm working in Florence in Tuscany. So the, my presentation is about, is, to, is about 13 plants and the results, and of course the complication and the advantages of this surgery, wonderful surgery. For example, the, 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 the time of surgery is now is less than two hours. The first implants, the time were, were, was uh, about four hours. So the learning, curve, the learning curve is very important in surgery because of course it's a complete surgery. We start from an external part of the eye to put the band, to put the external part of the, of, the, of the implant and then we go inside to the trachectomy, placing the array, the 60 electrodes array on, right on the macula with the tack. I, I think it's, it's very complete surgery and it's sometimes it's very difficult surgery. But we uh, did a good survey uh, on about the satisfaction of our patient because it's very important it's to eat and uh, we observe 80% uh, uh, of our patients are very satisfied. And sometimes they, 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 they said that we change their life. This is very important because of course they, they pass from complete darkness, years, years of complete darkness to see something. Of course, it's, it's, it's a rudimental vision. Of course, they can see the object, they can see the, with the door, the window, but of course you, you can see after years and years of darkness, to see something is a wonderful experience. It's not, not only wonderful professional experience, also probably it's a personal experience. We change, we change, we change the life of patients, life of families sometimes. Is there, are there, you know, this is relatively a new procedure, relatively new, it's been out for a couple of years, but it's still yeah. relatively new. Are there any pearls you could give to a surgeon who's looking at part of the show, uh, the artificial vision for their patients? What would you recommend to them? Uh, I think the first procedure has to be uh, has to be done with some somebody is very experienced on the, your side because of course I'm traveling a lot to help my, my other surgeons, other friends to start. Uh, we opened many sites all, all over the world. I was in in U.S. I was in Saudi Arabia. I was in Germany. I was in and many, many, many places in the world, because of course I think it is, it is, it is the, 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 I always say that it is not the difficult surgery, but of course it's surgery comprehensive or many tricks. Like, and then it's because it's different from normal vitrectomy or normal scalar, scalar blocking procedure, but I think we need to have something, somebody very, very, uh, very bright in this, in this field. But this is the, I think the one of the trick I can give to to my my, my colleagues. What's in, in your experience, and how, how in dealing with other uh, physicians who've been trying to deal with to take on this surgery? What's the learning curve like? I mean, is it is it very difficult, or is it just a matter of being having the experience to do it? Uh, uh, I think I think it's not very difficult. Of course, I already said that is complete surgery. But it's not difficult. But of course, you can you can have, you can have, you have to be a very very good surgeon to a very to, to start this kind of surgery. But all the side that the company opened are are with very good surgeons. I think the best of the world is uh, the the retina world is is doing this now is is doing these surgeries. So my la my last question to you is: What's the take home message for retina specialists? I think we open a new, a big door, because for the first time we implant something that can help our patient to improve the, their vision in, in a very, uh, very effective manner. You know? It's because we were very dubious about artificial vision, but I think we open a very, big, a, a great door. I think it's a, it's a new frontier, a new world.